Hello guys and welcome back to the channel. I returned to work after three days off with a back injury. See, I was in the gym the other day, Warrington David Lloyd's, and um, tried out a new gym, saw how it was, and I was doing some Romanian deadlifts. Um, pretty good form, to be honest. I've been going to the gym on and off since I was in my teens. So, um, I've never actually injured myself in the gym before. So, uh, my form's pretty good, I believe. And I was doing these Romanian deadlifts, and just as I was bringing the barbell back to the floor, my back just went, my lower back, as low down as you can get. Now, I didn't exactly know what this was at the time. I was hoping it wasn't a disc herniation. Um, but after going to see the chiropractor and I actually agree with her judgment, she thinks uh, my back just went into spasm to protect the muscle and to protect the spine, which, uh, you know, sometimes it does. And with that, you know, you get back spasms, but your body's literally just healing and there's no long-term effects. So the more I just get on with it, the better it can be. And I decided to come back to work today, even though it's still pretty painful. So we're back in business, just got to my first stop. The time is 5.30, looking really busy in the store today. I'm glad to be back working, can't lie. Let's go. <clears throat> Not so bad. Not so bad. Hey, how are you? I'm good. Here you go. I've got a marathon on, I think it's either the 8th or the 9th of next month. And you know what? I'm not even writing it off, who knows? Could get really much better within the next week. Thank God that it wasn't anything more serious. Um, right now it, it hurts more in the morning, you know, when I've just woke up, I've been sleeping, I haven't moved in hours, then I'm rusty. But the more I walk and just fight through the pain for a little minute, um, I'm better. But I'm still not standing right up straight. I'm kind of standing, you know, um, slightly bent over, but it is what it is. Hi, how are you? Hi, you're right. Yeah. Cheers. Yeah. Enjoy. Oh, I appreciate that. Thank you, man. Nice Have one. a good one. Bye. <sighs> uh, one pound, <laughs> one pound tip, one pound fifty tip to get us started and our second delivery. Right, third delivery, heading in the same direction as the last delivery. Um, do you guys get bored of this? I can't. Can't believe people are entertained by watching me do Amazon and Domino's, you know. I don't. <laughs> so am I, right? So it's like, we're probably not that advanced, but when you think of like some genuine billionaires, when you think of those guys who have built like literal companies with- Right, the time is 6.30. I've done three deliveries. I didn't film the final delivery, guys. I apologize. Have a free pizza on me. Um, now I'm doing a little trip to my previous store to drop off some things. Now, um, I offered to take, you know, I've got two tins of sweet corn, I think, and some other stuff that I'm driving to another store. You know, we did a trade deal, is what it is. I'm also going to pick up some lids for our milkshakes. Domino's now do milkshakes, guys. It's very fun to use the milkshake machine. And unlike McDonald's, this milkshake works. This mil milkshake machine works. So yeah, I'm off to my previous store. It's quite a nice night out on the road, feeling well, and you gotta be careful when it comes to red lights and green lights. Yes, indeed. But yeah, I, I offered to take this big uh, crate of food, and then I remembered, oop, we gotta be careful with the back. But um, yeah, it didn't didn't pull it again hopefully we don't pull it taking it to the other store in this particular circumstance i think it i'd be worse off sat at home right now 
Doesn't mean I could do an Amazon shift, but it means I'd be worse off sat at home. I decided that I spent years of my life, like three or four years, three years, like full time, sort of. All right, delivery number four. I'm going to deliver the fourth delivery now, and it's been waiting a while because because we needed lids for our milkshakes, and there was no lids in the store, so yeah, I kind of had to wait for me to get them to deliver this one off. Now here we are. You know what? The more you hop out the van, the less painful it is. Let me show you these drinks. We have our Domino's bags where we put our drinks in. He's also got a Fanta. This is the Domino's shake, Dommy shake. So this is kind of how, so this is kind of how my posture is right now. That's uh, how far I've been forward. Not too bad. There you go. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Well, guys, there was a spider. I thought I got it with that receipt. And then I opened the receipt and there was no spider. I've saw more spiders recently in the last month than I have for the rest of my life. Now there's one in my car somewhere. Hello, you all right? Yeah, how are you? There you go. Enjoy that. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. Take care. Right, 
three, six, seventh delivery of the day. Um, this order is 28.65 and that's the 140th order in this store. Let's just assume each one of them orders were 28.65. I'll put on screen how much like that total that total sum is. Obviously that's not in profit, but Domino's and pizza, it's it's a good money maker, guys, because think about it. Dough is not expensive. Tomato sauce. I can't assume all this stuff's expensive. And you can charge a lot for pizza. And look, I, I'm not going at Domino's or anyone else who charges a lot for pizza. People buy pizza. 140 families or people up to now. In one, um, what day is it today? In one Saturday night. So it's a really good money maker, pizza. But it's not very healthy for you. Right, the time is 20 past nine and we are um, nine deliveries in. I actually just got asked if I would like to go home. And I, um, I wouldn't like to go home, to be honest. I wouldn't. I just wanna, bro, oh, right? I guess I kinda like working, guys. I guess I kinda like working. I think we all do secretly. We can't wait to finish when we start, but it's really what uh, holds us all together and even being three days out at the employment game <laughs> it drove me a bit it drove me a bit mad to be honest. of course it's worse when you're like kind of stuck to your bed <laughs> and try to move as much as possible so when watch this car coming up trying to overtake me on the right yeah i didn't think so my guy when corona had started and everyone was locked down in the house I was so thankful to work at Domino's and for me I wasn't really I didn't really feel like locked down because I was going out to work every night and it really did um, help contribute to you know mental health so yeah pub busy on a Friday night people love to go to pubs in England there you go man take care uh, enjoy I think I could do a little run within seven days, I really do. Posture chair. The time is 10.30 and I've just walked through a couple more cobwebs. Oh, these spiders are out there, man. These spiders are out there. Right. In you go. Oh, that was my bag packed the day I went to the gym. I messed up my back. These are the clothes I was going to wear as well. That's good news though. I left this Domino's. This is my new Domino's polo. I left it in the back of the car. And I saw this one. And I saw this one um, in the wardrobe today. And it didn't fit me a couple of weeks ago when I tried it on. And now, 
it fits me a little bit better. Oh. Little update. My back is caving and it's not it's not feeling great right now. It's caving and um. so it's just got eleven. We've got an hour left. It's eleven oh three. Um between eleven and twelve other stores close and we pick up for one hour their deliveries. If we deliver one of those, we get an extra 125 per delivery, so that would be £2.50 per delivery. Um, I explain this in every video, but this will be at least one person's first time watching. So, let's go. Well, it's happened, it's happened. I've been talking about how easy Domino's is, but I forgot part of the order. I'm surprised no one got in touch with me. Right, I'm gonna give them a call now. Right, let's go and get the customer their stuff. And I just remembered as well, it's Saturday, so we actually close at 1am tonight, not 12. It's all good, my back needs it. But now I am going to get on with it for the next hour and um, I'll see you, I'll see you then, my friend. Right guys, actually 10 minutes later, that's a wrap. Let's go over what we made today. We did six hours, it's now 11.37. I started at half five. 10.58 times six hours is 63.48. That was our basic wage of the day. We also did 12 deliveries at the rate of 125, which is an extra 15 quid. So that's what we made for six hours work. Right guys, I'm off. I gotta get into bed. Hopefully we'll wax better tomorrow. See you soon.